Kelsey Nicole Nelson back here at Top Golf in Las Vegas, kicking off from Super Bowl week. I'm so excited to be back with Off the Field Wives organization. NFL Wives have been doing it all Super Bowl week long. Right now, we're preparing for the 23rd annual fashion show. Next to me is Ramonda Jordan. She is the co-founder of Off the Field NFL Wives Association. First off, Ramonda, what are you most excited about Super Bowl week? Wow, that's a big question. One of the things I'm most excited about is that it's the first. It's the first for everybody. So whether you are coming as off the field NFL wives to do our 23rd annual charity fashion show, uh, whether you're coming to a team to go to uh, the Raiders Allegiant Stadium for the first time, you know, it's a season of first for everybody. We're just so excited to be a part of it and also be able to give back. Uh, to a, a charity in, in Nevada, so. Yeah, I think that's so important. You talked about it being a first here in Las Vegas. We know Allegiant Stadium will be home to the Super Bowl, but you also talk about the charity part of giving back, which I think is so important. Talk a little bit more about who the charity will be for this year. Yes, we are so honored and so proud to uh, be able to um, give a portion of our proceeds to the Blitnikoff Foundation. Uh, very near and dear um, to my heart and to my co-founder, Sharice, because we are our Raiders, Raider Nation for life. <laughs> um, but uh, really with the Blitnikoff Foundation, they have been giving back for so many years and touching so many areas and making a great impact. But for them to make a decision to now come to Las Vegas and continue that um, way of giving, um, they are building a healing center, um, which is so amazing. Sharice and I were able to come um, in April of last year and get an opportunity to go out to St. Jude's Ranch and really visualize what that healing center is, is going to be for, for um, young ladies that have been in sex trafficking. And um, they're just really making an impact on like the healing, the education and all of that portion and really just trying to transform lives um, in Las Vegas. So we're, we're proud to be a part of it. Kelsey Nicole Nelson here in Las Vegas for Super Bowl 58, where we're kicking off a week full of events. I'm live from Top Golf in Las Vegas with the co founder of Off the Field NFL Wives Association, Sharice Brown. Sharice, first off, how are you today? I am well. Thank you for having me. Yes, I'm yes. so excited to have you. Sharice, there's a big event coming up on Friday that I'm so excited to talk with you about the 23rd annual charity fashion show. And I just saw on social media two tickets were already given away for the big game, hot price tickets yes. that you're organization has given. So first, tell us a little bit about Off the Field Wives. Off the Field NFL Wives Association. So a few of the ladies came together. We would attend um, our uh, players association meetings with our husbands who were on the executive board, came together and said, you know what, we need to get together and form our own organization that would support, you know, women, a sisterhood, but also support communities and give back in Super Bowl host cities. And that's what we came together to do. I have my co-founders, Ramonda Jordan and Ashley Brown and myself, and then we had all the sisters come alongside, and now we have over maybe 400 members that are part of Off the Field NFL Wives Association. That is amazing, and I know that there's a pink carpet, and you yes. are displaying that with your beautiful outfit today. <laughs> so explain the connection to pink, and yes. you know what are, what are you going to be wearing? Can we know early? Oh goodness. <laughs> so I'm still working out the details on what I will be wearing, but the pink first is one of my favorite colors, and one of my. Um, my sister Ramonda Jordan's favorite color so but our organization also is the color pink and you know and our logo has the football so it represents the NFL you know it represents our husbands who are former NFL players my husband is Tim Brown um, Heisman trophy winner Hall of Famer so it's been a wonderful thing to be their support system off the field so while they were on the field we were supporting them off the field and wanted to let them know that we could handle anything that was thrown at us as well <laughs> I love that because I don't think the women get enough credit, they right? They don't. And I think that's why this organization is so important. Yes, we know Super Bowl week, everyone's talking about the men here, yes. but they can't do what they do on the field, as you said, without the wives, right? At the games, you know, at home, taking care of the kids. And so, what are some of the stereotypes that this organization hopes to break? You know, um, definitely just being a, a, a stereotype of being just a woman along their side. You know, um, we want to show that we are doctors, lawyers, entrepreneurs, and that we can come alongside and do things in these wonderful communities like give back, you know, um, being philanthropic and giving back to, you know, all these different women and children's organizations are the ones that we always support, <clears throat> excuse me, and we're excited about doing that. This year we're uh, benefiting the, um, uh, I'm like the Fred Belitnikoff, I say it as Fred because Fred and Angela are personal friends, but the Belitnikoff Foundation, which um, they um, have, they're building a 
a healing center for the uh, St. Jude Ranch, and it's going to be for young women who have been sex trafficked, uh, drug use, and things like that, to give them a place to come. They're also going to be able to build a school eventually, but it's, you know, just an amazing, amazing foundation. Everything that they're doing is wonderful as well. So you're busy, to say the least. <laughs> we are definitely busy. Yeah. We are definitely busy. So my husband and I are also doing an event Thursday morning at Top Golf, and um, we are doing that with uh, Elizabeth Smart, who, of course, everyone knows it was adopted. You know her story, and once again, supporting her Maloof Foundation, her Elizabeth Smart Foundation. Once again, bringing awareness and light to a really bad thing that's happening in our world and we can't close our eyes and pretend that it's not happening but it is and we just want to bring awareness and raise money for her to be able to um, do her initiative and her initiative is to teach children self-defense against predators that might come after them you know yeah so, yeah. so important very very important very important yeah. so not only do we get to walk the runway with our husbands and that's gonna be so fun know, to see you guys walk with the husband it's <laughs> gonna be so much fun we're so yeah. excited so many wonderful things going on in the show so I'm telling everyone come out and yeah. come and support us because definitely for charity but also just for a fun time our event is one of the marquee events at Super Bowl so yeah. I'm telling you we know we sell out every year so we're hoping to sell out this year so come <laughs> get some tickets come purchase some tickets and come attend yeah yes, I'm looking forward to it yes. on the pink carpet yes. Therese will be there again come yes. learn about this great organization and again come party for a good cause yes. and also see these ladies uh, rock the runway yes. Charisse it was so great to have you thank, thank you, you so much for joining me we are looking okay. forward to Friday and again hope you all can join us. Thank you so much.